hear you. Uh, we can't hear. Oh, no. Okay, hold on one second. Let me see what's going on. More technique. I know. I'm telling you, man. Streaming and easy. All right. Uh, right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Can, can you hear him now? So let me know the comments. Uh, I'll read the comments in a bit. So let me quickly send this. I've got the comments on my screen. Okay. Uh, see, multitasking, man. I'm telling you. I th apparently, girls are better at multitasking than boys. Huh? Maybe you should get one in. <laughs> okay, let me just. <laughs> that is so naughty. <laughs> Everyone, just one second. I've got to send a quick link, okay? Uh, here is that link. I believe they can hear me to now. To the live feed. They can hear you now, yeah? I hope so. I think so. All right, let me just read the comments quickly in case I missed something. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. All right. Okay, let me say, okay, George. Yeah, George is in the house. What's up, man? So everything is good. All right, that's cool. And Ask is in the house as well. What's up? Uh, I said, uh, I have a name. <laughs> Ask is I have a name for the coronavirus pen. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, let's leave that a bit later. I'm looking forward to that. And George also said uh, the Vanina Road stuff, for real. Uh, Rockers, uh, we can't hear him. Okay, okay, sort on out. We can't hear both of you. Okay, so now everything's working fine. All right, so. There we go. Let's see what everyone said on Instagram, what their favorite B14 car was. Or do you what guys want to guess pole? first? What was on the poll? I know you put so, the last one. So, all these cars they brought down last year. So, the Vanino, the 918. Uh, the Wire Roadster, the two laughs, and what did I miss? Did I say everything? Yeah, so all those yeah. were on, on the poll yesterday or this morning. It either be the Koenigsegg or the Lambo. The Koenigsegg or the Lambo. Okay, yeah. let's, have, let's have a look. Let's have a quick look. No, no it'll probably be the Laugh of Uh. Oh, <laughs> Oh my gosh, you're not gonna. <laughs> so basically, on the poll, what I put was up the Venino, the LaFerrari Aperta, the, the regular Laf, the Koenigsegg, and the 918, the Pagani Wire Roaster, and the Toyota Prius. The Toyota <laughs> took it, didn't it? So, all right. <laughs> so, actually, it's not. The top ranking car in the vote on Instagram is actually the Venino. The LaFerrari uh, came second. And the third car on the list. No! I should have got that one wrong. No way. That just changed dramatically. Okay, all right. So the top is actually the Wire Roadster. Really? What? I, I was not expecting that. For real. Mm -hmm. Actually, let me see if I can plug it in so I can show you guys on screen. I was That's quite surprising. That. Like, you think all the cars that he brought that were yeah. first to London's one of, uh, is it one of nine on the Vanina Roadster? Yeah, exactly. Like super. I think. Yeah, it's the only black one because it used to be a different color and it got painted. Yeah, yeah, because it's got the green interior. I believe it was the green one from some. Yeah, and then it got it painted it black. Wow, I didn't I didn't know that. Um, everything is frozen all of a sudden. Uh, is everything okay for you guys? I don't know if B fourteen was in here. We could ask him himself. Yeah, I know he's like uh, I, I think he's watching because he asked me to send him a link and I have. Uh, let me just. I see think I think that was um, the story behind that car because it was never originally came out of factory black. I believe it was green. Yeah, I didn't know that. But why why are you guys frozen? Hold on, let me just refresh. Um, bop, 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 bop. Yeah, I, I did. I, honestly, that that's news to me. I didn't know that. See, there you go. Oh. This, this is why having guests on the show is very important. <laughs> you know what? The thing is, for for me to have him live on here, I gotta like get his Skype. Quite annoying, really. Hmm. Okay. So, like, everything's a bit delayed right now. I'm listening to you, but I already heard you. <laughs> it's so weird. Uh, yeah, okay. no, I'm watching it on the TV and it's delayed. 
Oh no, George, I feel sorry for you, man. So George basically only saw the Veneno. <laughs> he didn't see anything else. I saw everything except uh, the wire. So yeah, that sucks as well, unfortunately. But you know, you can't see everything, man. It is, it is how it is. Yeah, unless you live in London. Oh, it's much better this way. But then, uh, hold on one second. I'm trying to make everything work. Uh, okay, let's go back to the live screen. Woo, okay, that's much better. Okay, we're back. I think what I might do right now is uh, let me play one of the videos of, um, of uh, B14's cars. Let's do that. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I feel sorry for George. I'm sorry, man. It's like he, I literally saw everything except the wire. So, okay, let's do this. Let's play this clip. <laughs> Let me choose a file. I'm, I'm still shocked the Wira is the most voted favorite car from uh, B14's collection. That, that, that is a big surprise for me. Yeah, but you think about London and how many people fanboy for Garni. Yeah, I mean, it's like, it's crazy. All right, let's play this video. Let's see if I can find it. So should I start with the Veneno then? <laughs> Okay, what do you guys want to see first? So you want to see the, the, is the 918, the two LaFerraris, uh, the Venino, or do you want to see the Regera? What do you want to see first? Save the Venino for last. Save the Venino for last. Okay. So should I start with... Um, the Laughs. The Laughs. Okay. Which one? The Aperta? Yeah, that's the white one, isn't it? I don't know if I... Is I'm that right. the day where you uh, saw... Abamyang and his laugh as well. It's a double yeah, it video, a, isn't it? Yeah, it was the same day for real. <laughs> yeah, it's a double video. Yeah. So let me show you guys the um, the Regera first, then. Yeah. The crazy one. <laughs> the crazy one. <laughs> okay, here we go. So. What's up, everybody? So, welcome to South Kensington. I'm currently making my way over to Nice Bridge KB face. because uh, it's the third day of B14. I'm just trying to watch the TV to see when it updates. Is it is a uh, is a movie playing right now? Well, well, on my TV it's still showing us, but obviously it's delayed. Move back, guys! Move out the way! Move back, guys! Move out the way! Oh, there we go. It's on. You can see the video now, yeah. Yeah. Man, that's like about ten seconds delay, man. Jeez. I know. Yeah, it's through my phone, so. Sorry, people, you can't see me, but it's all right. It's all about the cars today. What are you said, man? I'm all right. <laughs> yeah, I'm relaxed, to be honest with you. So what do you think about the Regera? You like it? Yeah, it's all right. It looks pretty nuts on the road, but meh. But you wish it was kind of Condor yellow, didn't you? Like, oh, Condor, Condor yellow, yellow, mate. That is a flex. 
Condo Yellow Regera, man. That would be so That'd sick. That would be amazing. For real. Yeah. 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 Alright, the chase is on, man. Yeah, the chase is on. So look at Freddy trying to get on the... <laughs> Where is it? Freddy's trying to get in the car. He's on the road. Yeah, he still is. I won't run you out. Inside uh, HPH is... Um, what's your car called again? <laughs> Golf R. It's a Golf R, yeah. So basically, we've been chasing the Prince of Saudi Arabia. And uh, we caught up with him somewhere in South Kensington. Oh, shit, shit, shit. All right, put the window down, the window. This guy in London right now. So he has a Venina Resort and he's got this. What a combination, man. The color spec is on point. I've been running, man, so I'm out of breath. But uh, yeah, this is the car that I really wanted to see after the Venino. And it looks amazing. There literally is no plan to this. We're just uh, basically just following the car and see where it ends up. We have no idea where they're going. Uh, we're gonna carry on film, man. Ain't never gonna stop. Because I've never seen a Regera like on the road. Uh, this is the first time I've ever seen it, especially in London as well. In McLaren Center, literally came out of nowhere. I mean, what is going on, man? Ah, I gotta try and catch it. Was the leap worth it? Yeah, yeah. Say absolutely. Two, gonna... new, two new hypercars. <laughs> That's oh, madness. Really, really sick ones to see as well. That yeah. Senna's maybe the, one of the best specs I've seen. Yeah, for real. Volcano Red, I think. That is so sick. Ooh. Yep, not a bad day so far. But I must admit, man, I'm kind of smelling a sweat right now. It's hot. <laughs> it's hot in it. Yeah, all that leaping, man. See, this is what we, we, get, we do for Ooh. you guys, man. We do everything to try and capture all these amazing cars for you. Uh, Hope for you guys, gram. for the gram and for the YouTuber as well. <laughs> so I hope you guys like it. Feel free to like, share, subscribe and all that stuff. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Oh, maybe a bit later if anything else comes out. Check yeah, this guy out maybe. on YouTube as well, Mr. <laughs> TFJJ. Instagram, so, YouTube, the, the same. And I put yeah. the handle in the descriptions. Oh, cheers. And uh, over there, we've got Mr. HPH. NASA. <laughs> <laughs> NASA HPH. Space oh, man. So, space, space man. Also check him out on uh, Instagram as well. Oh. You're not a YouTuber, are you? Are you on YouTube? He does, he does a bit. He does a bit. <laughs> okay. IGTV. IGTV, alright, so. Alright, so check him out on HBH TV on Instagram. <laughs> Horsepower Hunters. Or the NASA, the NASA man. The NASA man. <laughs> <laughs> ah!
What have I just done? <laughs> oh, what? my gosh. I, I, I pressed the wrong button, didn't, didn't I? Um, let me just uh, read some of your comments and stuff. Uh, <laughs> so, basically, uh, As said, uh, like you just zooming in on her face. Yeah, it had to be done, man. <laughs> That's what the zoom camera is for, man. It's got to be done. So, look, so what is your what are your thoughts on the... And the Regera as a car. Uh, incredible. Yeah. When you think about it, considering what, how long ago did that car come out? Like 2016? 20, was it 2016? Was it 2017? Yeah, cool. was it? One of the two. But it's only been yeah. around for a couple of years already. Yeah. And for the fact that it's taken that long for one to come to London, it's not a good thing, but it's quite incredible to see it on the road. Yeah, I just remember the carnage it caused. Like when it came up the lift... And uh, it, you know what spoilers are like, right? When the oh, yeah, people team comes to chaos. town, man, it's like, yeah, just complete and utter chaos. And it's crazy when you're hearing all the cameras clicking off in the video, like when you're playing it, it's, it's kind of nuts. But that security guard was losing his mind. It's like, <laughs> at the beginning, it's, uh, yeah, it's a madness. Yeah, I think the Regera is an insane car. I mean, just seeing that thing on the road was uh, pretty impressive. I mean, seeing like a car like that just once is, is, is insane. But then to bring like five or six type of cars, like... In one go, yeah. Crazy. In, in one go, yeah. That's who else does that? I don't know. Uh, KHK. KHK, yeah. Has he brought that many cars in one go before? Uh, he brought P1 918, Lath, Veyron, yeah, TDS. Oh, I'm trying to remember what was on the back of the truck, and there was something else in the truck at the same time. Because yeah. I remember they, they dropped the 918 and cracked the carbon floor. Ouch. I don't think I was... Was that around back then? Was that before my time? Mm, it was before I'd done my legs. So it was 2016 in the summer. Yeah, that's definitely before my time. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's, that's, that's when I was still a, I was still a newbie. Uh, what did George say? That Regera is insane. Completely different to anything else. For real. It just looks like... This is the thing I like about Conic Zex, right? They, they're just not different visually, but they're different in terms of like engineering, like ethos, everything. I don't know any other car brand that does what Koenigsegg does. It's insane. And, yep. uh, Only issue at the minute is how many cars they're pumping out. Like what? Pumping out too many, too many cars. So you've got they've just ascended the Agera. Now you've got the Esco and the Regera, and now you've got the new one. Yeah, but compared to, uh, like, I don't think. I'm worried that, and I hope they don't go down the route of Bugani, where they yeah. say, oh, the end of a line, and then they still pump out 10 cars 10 years later. So the thing is, though, you have to think about, like, because every car they pretty much make is unique to the customer, at least in the case of Pagani, it's like, every, like, Zonda is different from the one that came before. So they, they make everything very bespoke to the person's requirements. I guess that makes the cars very special in that way. And yeah, also, they don't that make line was done cars. 10 years ago. But they have to make money, man. It's like... Uh, yeah, true. It, 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 you can't like, uh, design a whole car, you know, a power train and everything. I only sell five. You know, like, yeah. you're going to be losing money. So they have to find ways to um, basically stretch out one model into different versions to make money out of it because they're highly expensive cars, aren't they? Yeah, what? They've stretched the Agera 10 years because they just finished the RS. Yeah. I feel like they've gone from the Regera to the Esco way too quick. <laughs> oh, I've got to say, man, for me, the Yesco just blew my mind. I, 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 I'm probably, if, if I was a betting man, right, I'd probably say B14, he would probably get a Yesco. Yeah, what but which version? He'd it, probably get both. <laughs> if there's anyone in the world who's going to get both of those cars, it, it would be him. He'll get the, the Absolute and the other car as well. Because he got two laughs. Who does that? Yeah, but do you see the picture he posted earlier of all the Bugattis? <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't see that one yet, no. Oh, posted all the six versions of the Bugattis outside the um, the house in France. Oh, yeah. So the, basically, uh, it, yeah. it means it, he's there and he's probably specking something. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I don't want to miss any comments and stuff if, uh, if there's anyone saying anything. Okay, that's all cool. Um, no. Yeah, it's, his collection of cars is absolutely insane. He, he has no loyalty to like one car brand as such. He's uh, a very rare kind of owner who basically, he just buys every Everything. car. <laughs> it's like, it doesn't matter what it is. Like, it doesn't matter, like, what expense or whatever it is he just gets. I remember, like, meeting him for the first time. I think it was 2016 or 2017 when he was the first person to have uh, the, the show. Do you remember? Oh, yeah. yeah the... I remember that. 
I remember that because I was the one that broke the news it was coming out. Yeah, it's like I remember, like, <laughs> I remember like after work legging it to Central, and I think it was it was late in the night. I was about to give up because I it was eleven o'clock at night. Yeah, I posted it into every single group chat that he was coming out because I couldn't make it. And then this car got found at one o'clock, parked down the side street by four five eight MRP. Yeah, because uh, I literally filmed it as it was coming down from Green Park uh, towards uh, Berkeley Square. And I just remember, I think I was with Temdry, and uh, I just remember him, him, he started swearing and running. I was like, why is he running? And then in the distance, I saw those eight lights. I was like, oh my gosh, you're going to be kidding me. Mm-hmm. And at that time, I didn't know who B14 was. I was like, I just yeah, no started. One, I, I didn't know anything. So this blue, like, uh, Chirot turns up. I was like, what the hell is this? I remember filming it and then uh, putting it on YouTube and stuff. And that's when I realized how exciting this whole thing was. So, yeah, that was my introduction to B14. Does he still uh, have that car? Because I know he sold the Grand Vision, Vision thing. Yeah. The Grand Vision's now owned by Helby. Yeah, I think it's in America somewhere, isn't it? Didn't yeah, it's owned America. by the guy with the um, Helby and the Hellbug. Yeah. Damn. I, I, yeah, I don't know if he's still got the... To be honest, would he still keep the Shiro after like all the different versions of it have come out? I don't know. Yeah, but it was the first ever Shiro, though. True. And we haven't seen it since then. Yeah. I guess I don't know how many cars does he have. This is another thing. How many cars does do does B fourteen actually have in his collection? Does I mean, if he's watching right now, he could uh, text him. Like, oh, wait, there's so many. <laughs> like that two fifty GTO as well. Let me just check. Does it have two of them or something? Did someone say he has two? I, of, uh... I mean, if he wants one, I've got one for Sal. You got one for Sal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's saying that at a reasonable I know price. Uh, sixty five million. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What color? It's red. 65 million. That's about 65p to it. Are we talking about dollars here? They're pounds. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a madness. That's, that's, that's absolutely it's madness. Got, it's got full service history from Ferrari. It's got everything. For 65 million quid? Yeah. Just text just text B14 if he wants it. <laughs> Hey, B14, if you're watching, uh, you, can, you can get another, well, t- 250 GTO in the collection for a slip by 65 million quid. Wow. That's... I mean, there's only 37 of them, isn't there? I, I don't know, man. It's, it's all like, if anyone knows, you will know. And I think George will know as well. So, it's, George. I, I believe there's 37. Damn. What, what did George say? The, um, so, plus, oh, so if someone's willing to give you 3 million for a custom Zonda, you're not going to say no. Yeah, for real. It's really? uh, yeah, it's crazy though, isn't it? It's like um, the whole hypercar scene has completely evolved and changed like uh, beyond like recognition. I think I blame probably McLaren for it because the F1, I think, changed the whole the whole scene when it came out in 1992 or whenever it came out. Yeah, but then the Veyron in 03. Yeah. So. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. It's like uh, the, the F1 started it because people realize you can actually make hypercars now and there's actually a market for it. And then VW realized it with a, with a Vero when it came out. And then the LaFerraris came out. So all these hypercars just came out of nowhere. But I think the F1 kind of showed everyone the way of what, what is possible, I think. Yeah, but we're going in a new direction where you've got supercars that are quicker than hypercars. 720S, yeah. that is borderline, or probably quicker than a P1. Yeah, I think it is around the track. Uh, I read somewhere. Um, well, it's never it's never been posted anywhere because I don't think McLaren want that stat out there. But does it matter though? Do you think it matters? I mean, for like a P one is like a status car. I think the fact but, that it's seven twenty might be faster doesn't really matter because the P one is the ultimate of what you can get in terms of what McLaren made previously. Obviously, the seven twenty S came me several years later. It's going to be like oh yeah, but even then, uh, the lap difference between a GT2 RS and a Senna is not much, and yeah, the Senna is double the price. Yeah, because mm. uh, I done Silverstone last year in a GT2 chasing a Senna, and there was not much difference. There was, uh, it was a race oh, I was, I was there on a different day. It was a different day. It was a race between the Senna, the SVJ. GT2 RS uh, white pack, and the SVJ. Mm-hmm. 
say the first type of car is a Porsche 959? Probably. I don't know. What do you yeah, think? Yeah, because yeah, the F40 came just after, didn't it? Because the yeah. 959 was the car to 199, and then the F40 was on the broke 200 mile an hour mark. But would you, would you call would you call those hypercars though? For that era, yeah. Because they definitely weren't supercars. What? Hmm. I feel like a hypercar has to be something like a. I can see how the F1 is a hypercar, but I, I can't see an F40 being a hypercar though. A hypercar. Because yeah, it but, looks too. But if you go by the way Ferrari do it, F40, F50, F60, their flagship car is always that one. Like the F60 is the Enzo, that's there. And then the Laugh was the F70. So that line is always their hypercars. Would you put an F50 as a hypercar? I'll be honest, I'm not in love with the F50. I don't know why. Uh, I'm nor am I. Yeah, it's a strange one. It's like, I love the 288 GTO. I love the F40, but the F50, I don't know what happened, man. I'm just not in love with it. The front uh, don't look right. We'll get slaughtered. <laughs> the front doesn't look right. Oh my, we're getting sidetracked here, man. We, we, we're talking about B14's cars. So okay, so we've just seen the the Regera, which we think looks amazing. The spec was on point as well, in my opinion. Uh, I don't know what you think about that. You think the spec was cool or? Yeah, on point. You, yeah, absolutely. Just damn it, <laughs> it looked good. But uh, let's now look at some Ferraris. <laughs> so what do you want? The Aperta, or do you want to go with a coupe? Which one had the Barry hanging out? Oh, that was the... Aperta. That was Aperta. Yeah. yeah, we'll go with that one. Okay, let, let's place my Pertas. All right. Um, choose... Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is crazy day. Yeah. Only because of the Bami hangs in the video. Yeah. <laughs> okay, all right. Arsenal fans, so... <laughs> oh, Arsenal, man. You're going down, son. Hmm. I'm not sure about that wing or that McLaren, man. 720S. No. Uh, All right, boys and girls, welcome to so. day four of our B14. Let's see what it brings out today. What? Four hypercars, four days. The video is well delayed, man. Yeah, yeah. I'm watching it right now. Not on my screen. Team again. That is a car, man. Damn. What are you doing, man? You should be looking at nine eighteens, mate. What are you looking at Ferraris for? This. What are you looking at Ferraris for? This is the only car I take over on 982.5. <laughs> 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 
He's been confined, man. I mean, this guy has been sleeping with a 918 all his life, yeah. and today he's telling me that he's going to take a lap of change to 918. I'm a change to man. <laughs> oh, God <laughs> damn it. Yeah, it's cool, yeah. man. It's cool. All right, people, we've got some interesting facts about this La Ferrari Perth. The colors that you see on this car are actually the colors of Juventus. I don't know why it's got Juventus colors. So you're going to be ordering one? Yeah, anytime, anytime now. Anytime, yeah, yeah, for sure, man. I'll join you. Yeah, I think yeah. I might have some loose change in my pocket. We should cover it. <laughs> well, what, 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 what color would you get, though, if you're, when you order yours? There's only one color for these, for me. Same color as your hat. Oh, come on. <laughs> not, you, not red as well. Come get on. This huh? Get this one. No, no, You'll no. pay 99% of it, we'll pay the 1%. <laughs> you. Yeah, we'll no, the, the I'll, only get, I'll only get you one, right? If you get it this color. Really? Yeah, we have a deal. What that that looks like blue? primer. <laughs> <laughs> what? I prefer it with paint on. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Good job. <laughs> Alright, I'll let you no, off. Red, I'm afraid. Red, okay, I'll let you off. I'll let you off. Only because it's one of these, Ferrari. But, but the thing is, though, look, every Ferrari is red. So why do you want to be the same as everybody else? When they blend in. But why do you want to blend in? You buy a Ferrari to stand out, not to blend in. That's true. See, there you go. But <laughs> get it this color, I promise you, you stand out like crazy. Get all the girls as well. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now you get with, with my color. replacement hips, yeah. Oh, replacement. Oh, oh. <laughs> You're not original. <laughs> These incredible gold wheels. And also, the gold stitching in the seat is actually unique to this car. No other car in the whole world uh, has the same gold stitching and piping that you see on this car. Jonathan, get in the mangles, man. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone, meet Asian Jonathan. This guy is the, the craziest photographer from Asia, man, for real. He's matched his exterior color to his interior as well, in terms of the seats. And uh, somewhere in the center console, I think it says in Italian that uh, it's not over until it's over or until the whistle goes or something. This guy looks happy, man. Look at, look at, that, look at his face. The one of a can come. Of you course, man. Something. Especially the gold wheels as well, right? But uh, yeah, it's not bad. I will probably spec mine differently. <laughs> but it's not bad, man. And he's also done some pretty interesting things as well. Uh, when you look at the engine bay on the back, where it says Ferrari, his one is, uh, is black. Because of course it's a tailor made or tailor spec uh, LaFerrari, which means he's got bits on there that you don't get on regular LaFerraris. The engine, usually a red line in the middle of the engine, but in this one it's actually gold to match the wheels and the stitching and piping in the seat. Again, very, very unique. The air vents as well, they're also gold. Yep, everything's got to match. Everything's got to match. Yeah, so, anything else that one. you know about this that I should know about? I think you pointed them out. Yeah, the, He's the a human stroke. Google. Yeah, it's very unique to this car, right? Yeah. And the stitching as well. The best LaFerrari Aperta, I would say. Damn, that, that, that's a... Uh... Really? Yeah. Okay, I'll give you that. It's cool. <laughs> it's cool. I'm not sure about the gold wheels, I'll be honest. But I guess, why not? Good. So you guys visiting London or yes. you live yeah. here? So what's your experience so far? Good? Yes. We have visited before. Yeah. <laughs> okay, all right. And uh, you got a 50 out here as well. Check this out, man. Doors up. Because uh, it's going to be done. What's up? Oh, it's you. I was like, what the hell? What is... <laughs> I didn't know you were in town. How are you doing? You all right? Good to see you, man. You good? Long How are you? Good, yeah, it's good. been like... Look, it's Bayard, man. Oh, it's been ages, man. Like... When did you arrive? Uh, on the 7th. Well, this is Bayard, man. So it's like... <laughs> We go way back. <laughs> hey Jay, what's happening, man? Yes. Angles? Huh? What angles? <laughs> All round here, bro. No angles. Oh, I'm, not, I'm not as in shape as uh, the so rockers. You don't want to get in shape. All round to get here, your angles. <laughs> all 90s, 90s shape here. Everybody's waiting for the car to leave, man. That's yeah. all we're waiting for. But he's not going yet. Ah, uh, yeah. Could be any time. True. Who knows? Oh, oh fuck! Wait, the radio.
crazy to get down, man. Oh man, boys and girls, it's over man. So um the prince has left Harrods. <laughs> what a crazy day. Oh, oh boy, <clears throat> excusez-moi. Right, let me put this back to full screen. <laughs> hello. Oh, oh hello, you're back. Uh, yeah. Let's let's put this back, okay. Ooh, so that was uh, the second car. I mean, <clears throat> in terms of spec, your thoughts? I like the way how he's uniformed all his cars, but it's not yeah. my favourite laugh. Why? Because we've already got a white and gold one yeah. before in London, haven't we? Yeah. Ooh, let me swap these around. What am I doing? Oh, you just got another video on the screen. I oh, know, there we go, it's ended. My favourite <laughs> laugh. Yeah. JK's old one, the green one. I don't think I've ever seen that one. Incredible. I've never or, seen a green laugh. The one I really want to see is the one out in the Middle East, the purple with the yellow. Dark purple, purple. it's got yellow stitching. Wow. I'll have to send you a picture of it. Yeah, that, 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 that sounds ridiculous. It's like a... A purple laugh, wow. Yeah. I'll be honest, I've seen way too many red Ferraris. Like, like red Ferrari or red laughs. It's like to the to the point where it's like uh what is it? Can you <laughs> someone said Rockers, can you pronounce B fourteens? Yeah. I, I know it George, I know you're getting <laughs> I know what you're getting with this one. I'm not gonna fall for that. I'm telling you that right now. Um yeah, it's like uh, it's just red is just too much because Everything just this is too much red. I mean, I'm raucous red. Actually, I'm not today. I'm wearing yellow. But you know, you know, it's like it's too many red Ferraris. I like when someone does something different, like what B14 did with with his Juventus spec laugh. That's that's cool. It's different. Yeah. You know, the wheels for me was a bit overkill because it's too much gold. But still, I prefer that over like just a regular red red light Ferrari all day. Yeah, but those wheels are about eight thousand. <laughs> no. <laughs> Imagine curbing yeah. one. <laughs> Yeah, oof. Oh, ouch. In London, that's very, very easily done as well. So mm -hmm. he obviously spends, like, every Ferrari, every car he has is pretty much bespoke uh, to the point where on a regular lap, the line in the middle of the engine is not normally red, I think. But in that car, it was gold. So it was special customized for him. It's, it's crazy. Yeah. Because. So that's insane. But I heard that it's actually for sale somewhere in Saudi Arabia or something. Oh, really? Yeah. So I don't even have true that someone in the chat said it uh, in another stream previously. So I don't know if that's true or not, but uh, it might be. Oh. But uh, George said that Ferraris are usually red because of resale. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Resale yeah, red. Yeah, resale red, right? But I don't yeah, think Boris cares about that. No, he doesn't <laughs> <He's> care. Like, <laughs> he doesn't care about that. He will do whatever color he wants. Um, <clears throat> let me see what else is there. Uh, purple La Ferrari. I got that in my brain right now. I'm, I'm trying to like. That that is it like a deep purple? Or what kind of purple? Is yeah, it? it's like a proper deep dark purple. Yeah, with a yellow highlights or something. With yellow stitching. Yeah, yellow stitching. Is it the same guy who owns the purple SVJ? Oh, what, TBA. No. Yeah. Okay. No, it's not him. Yeah, because that SVJ is dope. Is, is that similar kind of purple to that, or is it different? It's kind of darker. Ooh. Yeah, that, 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 that is super special. When we yeah. jump off, I'll show you it. Yeah, okay, no worries. All right, let's, uh, I guess it's the next LaFerrari, the Coupe, or the Coupe. 
The only one in the world with yellow roof. <laughs> All right, let's play that one. Oh, is it? Yeah, that's uh, the only one, apparently, that has got yellow roof and nothing, no other car has it. It's oh. It's crazy. Um, I know there's cars that are full red. Yeah. But his one is the only one that's yellow in that kind of spec. Oh, yeah. George just mentioned the blue laughs in America. Yeah, I know which ones he's on about. The baby blue ones. The matching. The, the matching baby blue, blue life Ferraris. Oh, my God. Have you not seen them? Nah, I haven't seen those. Jeez, man. Imagine those. That, that is, see, that's so different. It's like, I love that kind of stuff. Yeah, but people in America know how to spec cars. Everyone here goes black on black on black. <laughs> Do you think it's because we're too much about a resale? Yeah, everyone cares about their values too much. Yeah, yeah, I guess. Uh, I don't know. All right, let's play the yellow one. I like okay. it a lot. I love the yellow one. I'm just not a Ferrari fan. What? I thought you were. No, I'm a Lambo. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's Lambo Lamborghini yellow. Lamborghini yellow. Uh, Good lad. Lamb Lamborghini gold. I mean, it's like... I, I'm not really like... I mean, I love Lambos, don't get me wrong. I think I'm more of a Lambo kind of dude, but I also love Ferraris as well. Just not all of them. Like, my favourite, like, F40 and 288, I love those. I love the laugh as well, in the right spec. The yeah, 250, I'm not really... I know it's got its high value, but I'm not really... Eh. Best Ferrari to me is the TDF. Yeah, the TDF is pretty cool. But I also say the 355 is pretty dope. It just has the right proportions for me. It look, it's, it's a beautiful or the, did you see the Enlargo that came to London last year, the white one? Yeah, that loud, I don't know what that was. like. That was incredible. It, it, I, I found footage of it, like literally, is it like two days ago, I was searching for stuff. And I got a clip of it, like going towards Harrods. My gosh, that was like something else. Literally everyone stopped and looked because they couldn't believe what they were actually hearing. Imagine it's, that through the tunnel. That probably make your ears explode. Yeah. That's probably what it would do. You hear, literally, your eardrums just go poof, just like that. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, that is, I don't, what exhaust has it got on it? I don't know. It's like a... it's a um, novice tag. Bloody hell! It's basically just um, from the headers down, so it's just straight. I'm surprised not too many people do that as well because uh, it just makes the car sound so much better. Yeah, but in Largos, there's only ten. Yeah. Because uh, Novitech are really tight on how many cars they built, so they only built 10 in Largo S's. Yeah, I guess it makes sense. Exclusivity and all that Yeah, stuff. and then there's the... Have you seen the pictures of the one in San, Francis uh, San Fran, the orange one? Oh, that's a beautiful spec. So many good cars in the world, and we have all black. You've already done a laugh. You've done the white one. That was the most important one. Uh, you've done the Regira and the Laugh. It's up to you, I don't know. be two hours before you know it. That's probably why we're so delayed. Yep. Yeah. Uh, that is literally the place to find me on us. LJB Photos on Instagram. Yeah. Don't do YouTube okay. yet. On YouTube. What are you waiting for, man? I'm just not for video. <laughs> he's just a photography guy 
Yeah. Uh, let me see if I missed anything. So as I said, uh, I think the Corona pens. Oh, okay. All right. Corona pen. So we had this discussion yesterday. Where, where, where is Corona pen? George oh, said no. he can't hear you. Who can't hear me? George. Oh, no. Um, hold on one second. What have you done? Can't hear you. But can you hear me, LJ? I can, but hang on, let me turn my TV back on. No. Uh, you can't hear you've me gone, either? No, you've gone silent. Oh, for God's sake. What's happening? You can hear me, which is the good thing. <laughs> yeah. All right, let me see what's happening. Something has definitely gone... Uh, I don't want to use that word. Um, <laughs> what is going on with this goddamn thing? Because the, the monitor sound, looks like it's a, it's a... Oh, okay. Let me just check. Make sure the battery hasn't died. Oh, we can hear you. Oh, it's just it's really good, quiet. It's good now. I didn't do anything. Let me check. Let me, let me find Corona Pen. Hold on. Wait, Wait what? Corona pen. All right, here she is. Because basically, yesterday, the homework was to find a name for Corona Pen. So, <laughs> so okay. Ask. I'm not getting involved in this. Nah, you can get involved as well. This... She look, she needs a name so bad. Look at her eyes. She needs a name so bad. So asks, um, the name you've given Corona Pen is Zoe. <laughs> why, why is she why is she a Zoe? <laughs> that's that's too funny. Oh god damn it. So we got a Zoe, okay, that's cool. And LJ, what name do you want to give give her? Something PG. Something huh? Something PG, okay. Oh, oh yeah, I was thinking PG. Yeah. Um, oh, <clears throat> I'm just trying to think of someone that has a messy hair like that. <laughs> oh man, she's been called Corona all this time, but she needs her own proper name now. So thanks for that name. Um, he asked Zoe. I'm curious why you call her that. Um. Ah, George is saying he, he can't hear both of us now. What the F is going on, man? I can Something hear is... both of you now. Yeah, he can hear us. Oh, he said he, oh, I thought he said I can't. What the hell am I talking about? Okay. Okay, that, that's good news. So, George, what do you want to call Corona Pen? What name do you want to give her? Please, something PG, always. <laughs> <laughs> she's, a, she's a bad dancer. So, yeah, I can see it. Okay, I guess it's always going to have to be the name, but... I'll wait for more names to come and then I'll pick one. <laughs> but Zoe is a very, very strong contender right there. Does she look like a Zoe? I don't know. There's names I want to say, but I'm not saying on camera. <laughs> <laughs> just look, at her, look at her cute little face. Oh my gosh, she's like, what the hell, man? Zoe? <laughs> oh, God damn it. Oh, that is... Oh, my laugh is so hard. So, yeah, I, I think this is the end of the stream, people. So I guess I'll catch you guys tomorrow f for another one. I don't know if I'm going to do... I guess we, we just finish this tomorrow. Uh, part two. Yeah, part two, yeah. Get the other cars done. Um, yeah, and George said uh, it wouldn't be PG. Oh, jeez. It, it's got to be PG, George. You know, it can't be any, It can't be dirty because YouTube would kill me otherwise. You know, you know it's... Uh, yeah, so... Thank you very much for coming on, uh, LJB. You're welcome. We'll do a stream about how we all kind of like, you know, like you, me, and Patch, how we all got involved with this whole car scene. Yeah, but we have that, to. That would be pretty cool. Yeah, that would be one hell of a... <laughs> that would be fun. But until then, man, take it easy and stay corona-free. I will. <laughs> Adios. Adios. Take it easy, people. Whew. Oh, my God. Where's the finish button? Oh, here we go. Catch you guys later. I have to go eat, man. I'm hungry right now. Did you get some food? What's up? <laughs> I said, I'm just talking to myself, not realizing that the mic is still on. <laughs> <laughs> I said I'm hungry. I got to get, I gotta get, get some food. Oh, I had food Ooh. just before. Yeah, I'm starving like crazy, man. I'm going to try and find some decent food to eat. Mm. Peace out, man. See you later, boy. All right, cool, cool.